Okay. All right. So you know what happened? All right. So they were on um, uh, the tiger hunt. Okay. So we're talking about Ringu. We're still talking about Ringo. And he was having uh, this problem that came up in their, their village because this tiger is loose. Now, there's tigers all over the place. But here's the thing. This tiger, it attacked a man in a village. And so sometimes when that, that's what they say is that when a tiger can, you know, I mean, they're supposed to eat things, you know, they're supposed to eat them. So it is now nighttime because the tiger hunts at night. And so it's nighttime. And so all of the men are all up in all of their different spots waiting to see what's going on. Now, no light, because if you have light, then, you know, then the tiger's going to see you. And then, of course, that light might trigger your way. So, so everybody's waiting in the dark. And when you're out in the dark, after a while, if you've been out there for, for a while, then your eyes kind of adjust to it. And so you can kind of see a little bit. And so that's what they were doing. They were all looking around, wondering. And, and then Ringu, he, he thought he heard something. So they looked at the noise again. And he got, there, there, there he is, there he is. He's over there. Hard. He was, they found, um, when Ringu came up, he found Greb Saeed trying to gather this, this like rock, I guess, to kind of help put underneath. And then that would help move around. But nothing that they did helped. And that's when he said, oh, Ringu, I'm so glad you're here. Maybe you can help us. Can, can you get the bullocks and, the, and, and, pull, and help to pull us out? Now, if you remember, Ringu, he's taken Mr. Grubb's harmonium, the little piano boxy thing. He's taken it. And so apparently he doesn't know that it's missing. And because he's asking Ringu for help. And Ringu's like, hmm. I don't know. I don't know where the bullocks are right now. You know, he's going to get the bullocks. Bullocks. We need to continue to, to talk to God and, and, and to talk to him and, and ask him to help you to do the right thing. And I think Ringu felt felt really bad. And I think you would probably tell by looking at his face that he felt really bad. He says, he says, before I go, he says, go ahead and we play the harmonium just one more time. You would like that, wouldn't you? And so he called to his friend Pandu and he said, will you get it out? And they started looking for it. Oh, no. It's not here. Well, I thought you put it in the truck. I did put it in the truck. <gasps> Do you think it might have dropped off along our way? Oh, no. Oh, Ringo, I want you to continue to 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 um, pray and continue to ask God and, and ask him for help so that you'll do the right thing. All right? Ringo said, okay. That night, Ringo went to bed. He was feeling really bad. He had lied and he had stolen. And as he laid there in his bed at night, he prayed and he asked God to forgive him. He felt so much better after that. Now, he still had he still had the, the harmonium. What was he going to do with it? I mean, he knows now. Okay, I got to tell the truth and I got to make sure I don't take anything. I don't want to steal anything. I don't forget. I don't like that feeling. So I'm going to not do that. I'm going to do my best. And I'm going to ask God to help me to do my best. But too. What would you do? I mean, because so far, nobody's given, nobody's given anything back. I mean, you just take it. To give it back? What would you do?